Hi, I'm Stephanie and this is my home, the 16th century Chateau de Lalande. Lalande was owned for hundreds of years by a family of marquises who were at the heart of French royal life. One of them even had the honour of being sent by King Louis XV to greet Marie Antoinette on her arrival in France. But, far from being a stuffy museum, this chateau is a living home. I live here all the time and I'm regularly joined by my mother, my family, my friends and wonderful volunteers from all over the world who help me to lovingly restore this historic home. Welcome to La Lande, a chateau filled with life, love and laughter. <laughs> Ta-da! Are we really allowed them already? No, but a special taste just oh. for the two of you. We're in the right place at the right time. Have a little taste. Plenty of butter in there. <laughs> so exciting. <laughs> That one. Right. That's my my choice, yes. Alright. This then. is the one. Then. How did you make them? What's in them? So mm. loads of sugar, mm. loads of mm. coconut, mm. loads of salt. Mm. Did I and say sugar? Oats. oats, yes. Yeah. Mm. 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 I've told her before and I'll tell her again. She's my dream woman. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's the love of my life. <laughs> already proposed once today. Well, anything to get those chocolates from you. Yes, and then nothing else now. This will be tucked away so you won't be able to get any more before dinner tonight. Harsh. So, no sneaky fingers. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to make cocktail corner out of this printer slash knitting cupboard. <laughs> yeah, well, it's a very useful combination of it's things. It's very useful. Because I always find when I'm knitting, <laughs> I need to print things. Marie doesn't like noise and fuss in the kitchen. Hmm. And the same time that we fancy aperitifs is usually the most stressful point of cooking. That's true. Yes, So we yes, need to is. move aperitif time yes. from the kitchen into cocktail corner i and i love that but at the moment that's not screaming sit cocktail down corner. and have a lovely cocktail is it no, nothing about it's that not. so and we have a very motley assortment of things well yeah do you want to explain <laughs> what this is that's um that's what that is yeah well presumably it was once the top of a gramophone oh so it is sorry it goes like that <laughs> I just assumed it was um, some sort of end piece for a tuba. Or, hmm. Well, you know, you, you do love you do love music, so you've gone straight in with a musical <laughs> I angle. I do love a tuba. Then we have a really nice Zulu basket. It's not working as an assortment of objects. And no. I don't think this is really working as a cupboard either. The knitting printer cupboard. Right, let's move all of this out. <laughs> Are you hearing me loud and clear? I actually am. I wasn't expecting it to work so well. We have another helper. We have Ryan from Life of Ryan, who actually turned up as a surprise last night. So this is super unexpected. I had no idea it was kept as a complete surprise from me, yeah. but that's really great. Um, and it means that we have a third person. Yeah. Yeah. It's the three musketeers doing the mm -hmm. cocktail corner. We have got something here that I looked at sporadically sort of every two years and thought I don't know what to do with this and put it back in a cupboard. It's time, it's time to sort this out. Because it's time I... for the world to meet. Yeah, Andy Pogrel. I don't know anything about this other than it says Andy Pogrel, 14th of July, 2012. And I'm pretty sure it has whiskey in it. <laughs> do any of you know Andy? Pogrel. <laughs> and if so, please tell him that for some baffling reason, we have a hip flask in his name. It's mm. even got a little funnel. Mm. And I don't want to just give this to the charity shop in case someone knows Andy Pogrel. So mm. if you do, please let us know. Mm -hmm. We're keeping the hip flask just that little bit longer for him. Good day. Ta da! The top still needs to be cleared, but look, the top needs wow, to be cleared. Look at that! I'm going to clean it, mm -hmm. and then you wanted us to get nice fabric, didn't you, Pat? I thought I thought so because it's nice. So, yeah. yeah. Yes. Make something really pretty here mm -hmm. for the glasses. All the way through to the drinks pantry. We will be needing definitely rum. Mm-hmm. 
and Armagnac. What else mm -hmm. do you think is... There's my brother. Yeah, I'll Limoncello. be taking that. You'll be taking, okay, you'll be looking after that. I like the lot. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> I think you've got a nice little selection. Oh, Amaretto, oh. maybe. Yeah. We don't have any of that there. What yeah. about uh, Guignolet? Yeah. You like Kirsch, don't you? With Kirsch? Yeah. Do you like it with, um... Oh, Creme de Mure. Well, let's take that through. Yeah. Lovely. Kat has come up with the brilliant, and I think, let's face it, genius. Yeah, genius, I think so too. Yeah, idea of putting the lovely little crystal lamp in there so that we can light up the inside of the cocktail cabinet. But we have a problem. We do. There's a hole in the back for the wire, but it's too small. Yeah, the plug won't go through. Plug won't go through, so. Wire needs to rewire <laughs> the lamp <laughs> to make it go through. Wire, can you rewire with the lamp? I can try. <laughs> and you've never put a socket on something, have you before? No. So this I is haven't. a super exciting thing for you. Oh yeah. Is it easier to rewire a lamp or just make the hole a bit bigger? Rewire it. <laughs> Definitely. Okay. Yeah, I think that's easier. I mean, how are we going to gouge out? What should we give you a little? Um, just a little chisel. nail a nail file. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Someone give Cat a nail file. <laughs> if I start, if I see Cat with a chainsaw, that's what I'm worried. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll borrow some of <laughs> Yeah, team rewiring grew. So basically, oh. Philip was passing through <laughs> and, uh, well, I said, Philip, do you know how to rewire? He's like, yes. <laughs> of course so I do. Philip has basically showed me how to rewire and he's done it as well. So yeah, the moment of truth. Oh yeah, let's plug it in. Oh, Philip, genius. Right, you Thanks. ready? I'm ready. Here we go. <laughs> no, <I'm good. laughs> oh, maybe we should turn it on as well. Yeah! 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 Fantastic! Yeah! <laughs> Is there anything you can't do? Okay, now, do I know it's quite <gasps> going on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I've got a bit of exoticism. Distant lands. Oh. Bringing back exotic liqueurs. I love it. Mm. So for the top and the bottom shelf, there's a little parrot as well. And that way, Absolutely if there's the odd perfect. drip, it won't show. Because I was looking at some yeah. like yellow silk and I thought, well, that's Absolutely last not. Evening. Yeah. Right. I will iron and I'll get the staple gun. Mm. And then I can edge. Oh, wow. That's, that's, that's perfect. Good. And Ryan is trying to unscrew the shell so that I can upholster it. I can't even see what it is. I think it's gone completely rotten. I think I can see the thing. I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll start side. with the easy one. Yeah, oh yeah, that is that much side. easier. There we nice. Go. So straight out it is. There we go. That's that. That's one. Wonderful. May the force be with you. Well, I don't think the force is with me on this one. Don't try and look for it. Just feel your way, Ryan. Use the force. Oh, I think someone's put it in at an angle. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, well, I can't even see it. Is no. there even anything there? Well, there was something there. What do you reckon? There's nothing there. Exactly. So I just like you said. Do what I'm saying, yeah. Yeah. As close to the yeah, 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 yeah. and, and hit it there. Should we be holding the lamp? Should I drop the lamp at the top? Oh, no, it looks yeah. okay, doesn't it? I'll come around just in case. Okay. Uh, oh. It's working. Yeah, I think so. Watch my fingers. <laughs> That's basically done. So what I'm gonna do? Yeah. Try and pry it off. It. Oh, Big Ryan, two. yes! Right, so I'm going to take this out. Are you sure that shelf isn't structural? <laughs> <laughs> it's not a good time to ask that question, Kat. <laughs> yes! So... Good, I will cover that now. And the beauty is, the good thing is, basically there was a screw there. Yes. That didn't, they had, the head was, was gone it was yeah. just rotten away and uh i didn't want to like try and get it out from this side yeah because i didn't want to ruin well we're gonna i mean we're gonna we're gonna be we're gonna put it back but we don't yeah. need to screw it down look how hard it was no. to get out even once the screws yeah. had gone so i just banged it out 
Great, well done. And it worked. We've happy got days. a powerful team here, haven't we? <laughs> we do. <laughs> just like use you look so happy, Cat. You yeah, look so I happy. Do. I'm ecstatic. This tea is spot on. Oh, is one of those for oh. me? No? Oh, yeah, no, well, one in the <laughs> no, I know she'd made me one. <laughs> I'm going to go get Act it. it. <laughs> I think yours is her ladyship. <laughs> Good man. <laughs> and you'll be lacking milk. I can do that, thanks. Michael Patrick has arrived. Just in time for us to finish the cocktail cabin oh, and have cocktails. The timing is as always exquisite, Michael. Well, right. we have been talking oh, yeah. about your espresso I martinis. There mm. certainly will be a martini. A dirty one. A very dirty one as soon as I got this. Dirty episode. martini. There. I like the idea of as you open the cocktail cabinet, you're taken to another exotic world, and this fabric is called Légende des Tropiques. Oh, the tropical legend. Mm. Yes. Oh. Yeah, it's going to be good. Obviously, I have it's to lovely. stretch it. A little. I'll do that now. Yeah. You've got staples. I've got staples. I have a staple gun. We are, mm. We're good to go. What is power. your favourite cocktail, Stephanie? Le Dirty Martini. Mm. Yes. And you? Um, I like something, anything citrusy. So caipirinha, nice. I like very much. The margaritas we had last night yes. were extremely good. Hello, hello Isabel. Hello, hello mummy. Are you having a nice day? Oh, hello. <laughs> I didn't know you were too me. Sorry, bye. <laughs> <laughs> you. <laughs> What's your favourite cocktail, Isabel? Water. <laughs> it's a nice cube. Yeah, that's a good one. That's the one I'm going to Shaken, not actually. stirred. <laughs> okay. Well, enjoy then. Be creative. It's like Blue Peter again. <laughs> there is a little wet patch at the front because whilst we weren't filming, I staple guns brilliantly into my thumb. <laughs> um, got a little patch of blood there but I think I've got it out so that's good and the thumb's all good yeah that's lovely ready and now the bottom, bottom shelf, shelf. how do you go about this the only way of doing the bottom educate me is stapling it in place ah. and then to hide the staples putting a little edging because there's no Ooh. other way of doing it like that okie doke now we have realized that we need to paint the inside of the cupboard red that's a perfect red. It is, it is. It will go really well with it. That's... I mean, it matches perfectly the, yeah, uh, the it details. Yeah, right. Oh, okay. Oh, I think we've it. got some left. This is Farron Ball uh, Incarnadine. Oh, Farron Ball. Okay. Farron Ball. <laughs> yeah. Let's do it. Okay, you paint one half, I paint the other. Yeah. Um, We're a very good painting team. Whoever um, <laughs> gets to the middle first wins. <laughs> okay, I like that. Go. Yeah. <laughs> well, I <think> <laughs> Oh, zero, right, we've gone for this red. I love it. Um, Incarnadine. Oh, it just feels oh, right. It does. I think it's right for this. This is taking me a lot longer than you because I'm holding the camera, to be fair. Doing it one hand at this. Yeah. Certainly a handicap. Uh, we're never going to get to have a cocktail, are we? Absolutely never. This, this has taken over the day. I had things I was going to do, I had plans, but now I live and breathe cocktail, cocktail corner. Cocktail corner, yeah. We'll have to just curl up in front of it and sleep here tonight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This all started, this is just going to be a very quick, this is what I bought at MOs and this is how we use it. But the tray, it's one tray. That this whole thing is for, <laughs> hasn't been featured once. Not we yet. Won't. Wait for its magnificent arrival at the end. Yeah. But that's the glory of my use. It sparks ideas. <laughs> it sparks joy. Marie Kondo would be proud. It's pretty neck and neck at the moment, actually. Yeah. Done. Ah. <laughs> I won by. Oh, actually, about four square inches. Yeah. What does the winner get, though, Cat? What does the winner get? Um, the first martini. Yeah, that works for me. Hmm. I thought so. Yeah. The project has escalated again. Uh, so we've painted the inside red. Stephanie insists it needs a second coat. I disagree, but she's the boss. So um, we're waiting for that to dry. Then we realised that meanwhile, the painting was halfway across it and it was very 
it, it was very unsettling, was it? Imagine mm. making a cocktail here and there's a painting just cutting in like this. Awful, gosh, Terrible. no, so I can't move imagine. the painting along. Mm -hmm. I'm going to now move this this way and then we're going to try and put the Singapore Sling poster over it. What's a uh, Singapore yes. Sling? Singapore Sling is a long drink invented at Raffles Bar at mm. the hotel. Uh, and Ryan's scaring me a little bit with this hammer, but he's ready for action. Yeah. He's, he's good to go. Yeah. Ready for some picture hook. Let's action! Go. Let's go. So I have to move. Do not kick right. the paint can over. Yeah. Oh, that would be bad. Okay, Ryan, I think that's right, in line with the bottom of my father's painting. Yeah. And then we need to put another painting above it. Mm. So we get a little row over the bar. Oh, yeah. I think you're right. Okay, let's go for that? it. Let's yeah. do it. Yeah. I'm just wondering how the bar snacks all ended up next to Natalia. What is this? I really like this. Yeah, that, I'm glad you said that, Michael. No, I've never seen this before. Where's it, where's it from? So one of my patrons came round from Germany on her way somewhere else. Yeah. And came all the way here. Yeah. And she made that for me. She made it? Yeah, it took her a week. Oh, I love which it. Which she said wasn't long, which sounds like a very long time to me. But it gets more exciting than that. Why? Because that over there, which we can open whilst cocktail corner is drying, that what? is for you. And apparently, well, I think it must be very similar because she says they match. So we're going to have each one half of a matching pair. What? Yeah, and I haven't seen what yours. Are these? Yeah, seriously, so open it because I haven't seen what it. Is? Yeah, and I don't know what it is. Really? Yeah, and I've been dying to open it. You've no idea. I've been dying to look at it. I've been eyeing that up since I arrived. I know. I think I want one. <laughs> Vivi and Amatos have just popped in unexpectedly. You're driving through France and they're on a big, big journey through France, but they're patrons of the chateau, so they popped in to say hello. And look, they've brought me a present and one from Michael Patrick as well. I really like He's doing it. charming. Let's take that off. Yeah, yes. I just put it back on for the. Wow. Yeah. Oh, I love it. They look really love it. it. Yeah, it's oh. And she's playing one of those games where you have to put the ball on the stick. Yeah, Did you make it? Yes. Yes. Oh, wow. Really like Since you said you have so many walls to fill. <laughs> I love it. It's yeah. beautiful. And it's actually like the pattern, uh, it's actually one pattern. And this is the first row and the second row is, is for Michael. <laughs> So yeah, I really enjoyed making yeah, it's fantastic. And, like, mm. This is really exciting. You know, I actually really like embroidery. Yeah, I know, I know. I really like embroidery. There's something not, so I charming. I, not, I've never done it myself, but I, I appreciate it. Mm. I really like embroidery. This is cross stitch, apparently. Cross stitch. Is yeah. it, cross stitch is a type of embroidery, I think, isn't Yeah, it? I think more, so. It's not, it's not free start, it's not free hand, it's mm. more square. Oh, oh. that's so beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, it's so good. Is it the same characters? Yeah. Uh, I mean, um, no, it's different. It's different characters. I've got two girls and a boy. And you've got two boys and a girl. <gasps> Let's look at them together. Oh, wow. I actually I love just... that so much. It's... Look at that. Look oh, at that. Oh, wow. Oh, they're that gorgeous. That is stunning. VK20. We've got a matching pair. How lovely. We'll have to reunite them one day and when, when we live together. Yeah. Who, who made these? Vivian. Oh, thank you so much for these. These are absolutely, well, I see these. This is, this is, this is your <laughs> No, one. but aren't they amazing? This, oh, absolutely love. You look at this, yours this, with the tennis. This is going to go in my bedroom. Yeah. Until the cottage is done. And yeah. Then it's got to go in there. And when we live together one day, Michael? They'll be reunited. They'll be side by side. Yeah. They look so good side by side. They're so pretty. I love the colours as well. You know this kind of um, burgundy red? That's actually my favourite colour. Yeah. Really was one of my favourite And imagine colours. that against the blue walls of your bedroom. The day when these are reunited is... Uh, it's going to be a happy day. Oh, I love it. I'll take this one too, yeah? Michael? <laughs> Michael? Michael! <laughs> I'm polishing up the tray whilst the paint dries and wow, it needed it. <laughs> the cupboard's starting to look really good. We are putting this at the base. Mm. Are you finding yeah. a good section? Yeah, I'm finding the man on his camel, the man looking on his out camel. to sea. Mm. That's good. 
I that like is that. good. I like that is going to look great. Oh, that red is perfect. Yes. I can't believe we had that lying around. It's amazing. Also, I was thinking, I just went to the garden to grab some parsley for garlic bread. Um, and I noticed that the gate to the vegetable garden is looking a bit shabby. Uh -huh. And it is almost exactly that colour. But I think we should paint it the same colour as the shutters now. That <gasps> lovely blue would be really pretty. Ooh. Yeah, maybe you're right. Right. Um, have fun. Thank you. Check in once the garlic bread's in the I'm oven. Looking forward to the garlic bread. Mm. So, right, the base is done. And here we go with the shell. It might be quite a tight fit because now it's got the fabric wrapped around it as well. There, does that invite you to an exotic land? It does. That Hello. I love your garlic bread. Look at that. That's that's super loaded garlic bread. That's it's not just garlic super bread. Loaded garlic bread. Oh. I um, don't know what happened. I picked up the garlic presser and then suddenly three entire bulbs had gone. <laughs> and a lot of cheese. And quite a lot of cheese as well. Oh my god, it looks good. Excuse me. Of course. <laughs> And oh, we get to have I it mean, with Mary's lasagna. Yes. Is absolutely better than Michael's lasagna. I'm just to let you know. Oh, is it now? Yes. What does Michael think yeah. of that? Well, he thinks that he's mm. lost the lasagna game. Ooh. This is what Isabel. Looking beautiful, Stephanie, I must say. Very glamorous. It's coming on really nicely, isn't it? We just need to get a few more bottles, some more glasses, and dress the top. I am lost for words. <laughs> it, it, it's amazing. <laughs> Was it worth you spending your entire afternoon learning to rewire and faffing, faffing a lot of faffing with Cocktail Corner? Stephanie, <laughs> I would gladly faff with you anytime. <laughs> okay, I've got that on camera now, you know that, right? <laughs> There'll be a lot of faffing ahead. Sounds good. <laughs> There's faffing in your future. <laughs> Just when I thought we were finished, Michael came in and said, no, no, no. Well, the front's lovely, it's got a lovely shine on it. Yeah. And um, the top's all gone matte and it's got um, watermarks where people have put drinks on it over the years and it's all sort of discoloured. So we're gonna we're gonna use some steel wool, rub it back, maybe give it a, just a hint of stain and then we're gonna wax it with proper antique hmm. wax um, furniture polish. Oh, I love having you here, Michael. Though at the same time, I felt pretty close to actually having a cocktail and I realised that that moment's just... It's got further away, hasn't it, Ryan? It has. It's got, it's got much further away. Mrs. Walker's cabinet. What? Is that who's it, who it belonged to? Yeah, it must be someone my mother knew because when I told her I was making a cocktail cabinet, and incidentally, I didn't tell her I was painting the interior, she went, oh, Mrs. Walker's cabinet. And she said it with a lot of love in her heart. And therefore, Mrs. Walker was obviously very important to my mother. And so I hope that we do justice to this and she's not too cross about the new interior colour. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I definitely thought. think we've improved it. Absolutely. Uh, we could do with a bit of sandpaper to us because this wire was quite fine. Mm. It looks so much better. Yeah? Yes. Now it just needs to be shiny. So you've done wire wool, then you decided it wasn't enough, moved to sandpaper, and now back to the wire wool. Yeah. Okay. It's amazing what it takes to have a cocktail around here. We've been working at getting a cocktail for seven oh, hours now. Oh, is terrible. <laughs> okay, is this the moment of truth? Well, I've given it a rub back. I just need to um, clean any of the dust off now. I'll <gasps> give you an idea of the colour. Oh, I love that. So satisfying. And this is just water. This is just getting no, the dust off. No, this is um, uh, turpentine. Okay. It's such grain. a pretty grain. It's all just different pieces. Look, you've got a piece there. Yeah, there's that's, another bit in that's there. That's a piece of walnut. That's a piece of oak. This is something else. I think it's all different woods. Can you see? You've got a circle there. Yes! A square, a square like a rectangle. And it's then very got... art deco when you look closer. It's subtle, but there is a pattern. Mm. I'd say late 30s, probably 1940s. It's lovely. It's Thank you, Mrs. Walker. It's not 30s. 30s was a bit. It's, not, it's definitely 40s. 40s is a lot simpler. Mm. Money was tight and. 
you know, they could afford to ship in expensive woods. So it's funny though, isn't it, how you look at a piece of furniture, this cupboard's always been in my family, and I've never thought about it, and it's really plain, and I just put a printer in it. And the more time we've spent working on it, the more you notice the yeah. details, and the more you love something. Mm -hmm. So what I'm doing now is I've got some of this. It's like an antique. This is a mahogany colour. I use that. You know the huge bed crown that I found yeah. in the attic for Mummy's apartment? Yeah. We don't want the full red mahogany. No. Look, so we're, I'm mixing it with um, turpentine to just dilute it. Okay. So get a bit of colour, but not, it won't be too much. Look at the colour here and the inside of the doorstep. It's the same colour. See that? Yeah, that yeah, that. that's color. right. Yeah, it's, that's correct. It's the correct colour. Definitely. This really is a group project. <laughs> Everyone's been involved in a different part Everyone's of this. Had an input, they? Everyone. That's true. It's truly the full chateau cocktail cabinet. Ryan's looking impressed. Look at that. <laughs> right. Not too shabby. <laughs> well, well, well. This top is so dry because I've used so much wax on it and it's just disappearing. It needed it, didn't it? It really, it really needed it. it. It says use it sparingly, but I it's impossible. Used, I, haven't, I haven't been using it sparingly at all. I've been using it probably way too much, but it's just disappearing. Slight problem. Uh, when you said it was supposed to be used sparingly. No, 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 no. it's quite liquid, so I just sort of tried to pour a little bit out. Oh, it just I went, see. It went and straight out. <laughs> so. Oh, it's like blancmange. It, it's not really wax. Wax, it's more like cream. Well, it's probably about 30 years old. I found it at the back of a cupboard, I'm pretty sure. Oh, well. Because it says beeswax in English, we brought it from England <laughs> 15 years ago. Well, we'll and be, I doubt it was new then. We'll be using a lot of it by the looks of it. Use sparingly. <laughs> That's what it says. <laughs> fake because actually it's now getting to a point where the wax has stopped soaking in. You really tested it. Yeah, look, look at that. You put it to saturation point. Yeah. Well, you should really. It's fed. It's <laughs> you its, fed it's it good it, and proper. It's had its feed. <laughs> now it's time to buff it off. This is it. We are ready because we didn't stop working. We powered through. Mm -hmm. It's what, nearly 11? Yeah. It's nearly 11 o'clock at night. We didn't take our eye off the ball. Mm -hmm. And we are ready Never. to reveal. Because we're not faffers. No, we're not. That, no, no one has ever looked at us and said, there go two faffers. No, no. And no one said that we were taking it out of hand. The, tray, <laughs> the purchase of the tray. Two euros. <laughs> we're two ready to reveal. French euros. Cocktail corner. Mm. Let's go down. Shall we? This is what happens when all the inhabitants of the chateau jazz up one two euro tray. <laughs> we are ready to reveal Lalanne's cocktail corner. Thank you, Michael, for making such a beautiful bow for the grand opening. <laughs> is everyone ready for this? Yeah. yeah. May the cocktails flow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I mean, the only question is, what's the first cocktail we'll make in yeah. Cocktail Corner? Well, my favourite cocktail is a dirty martini. Mm -hmm. So I'd quite dirty like to make... Martini. We've got the olives. Nice. We have the olives. Does anybody like dirty martini? I'll, I'll have anything. I'll have, <laughs> I'll have that. So that's two dirty martinis. Any more? Absolutely. I'm good, thank you. All right, two dirty I'm martinis the coming up. Please, can I pick up some ice for you? Please, <laughs> yes. One piece at a time. Shall we just So all day, here? basically, Stephanie's inspiration was the tray. My inspiration <laughs> was both smaller and bigger. <laughs> <laughs> can I offer you some ice? You can give me one piece of ice and then we'll pour the rest in. Otherwise, we'll be here all night. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, one by one. Look, hey, no, we've it's got... like the games of the arcade. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing magnificent. Thank you, I thought so too. We could stand here all night doing this and we'd be perfectly happy. <laughs> I'd be ecstatic. <laughs> Eight hours of work was worth it for this. It was. I just feel so. <laughs> we have Miranda to thank for the special fairy lights, and we thought they looked good in the green. Yes, and this is my current favourite theme. What is this, Shin? 
It's um, Mangwan Oligen. Oh. I genuinely bought this because I wanted to buy a bottle for Oli. And then it's an olive gin and it tastes really olivey, so it's perfect for a dirty martini. So now I'm slightly obsessed with it. Three parts gin. Ooh. One part new brat or martini. Mm -hmm. Service with a smile. <laughs> <laughs> to make it a dirty martini, you add some of the olive juice. I think that'll do very nicely. This one's shaken, not stirred. Purists like it stirred. <laughs> this is way more fun. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, bought us some uh, blanket de limo yesterday. Yes. I feel like this is a perfect opportunity it is. to crack it open. Wonderful. For the Kiehl's. We quite fancy some Kiehl Royale. Philip just brought this from Maastricht. From Maastricht, yeah. And it's strawberry liqueur. Wow. So it has to be that in the Kiehl, doesn't it? I think Are so you in too. charge of the Kiehl's? Apparently so. Is there I'll a spot for me on the cocktail corner? The <laughs> cocktail corner, <laughs> corner is a little cramped. I'm about to move out though. You should get like a sign. It's a very exclusive thing. Cocktail it's corner. very exclusive. We could only fit one person at a time in cocktail oh, corner. Name the bar Team effort really in action. Mm. There's enough see for someone else. How each individual part has come together right. to, for the whole. So lovely. I'm handing over cocktail mm. corner to the next inhabitant. <laughs> <laughs> well, too kind. Okay. <laughs> Great facial expression in the There you go. There you go. Well, cheers. 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 Michael Patrick! Even in your t-shirt, come back here. <laughs> cheers. 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 Michael, you were working so hard there was blood, sweat, and tears over the sanding of this, and you're allowed to be in your t-shirt. No, there was yeah. blood from mm -hmm. you. Oh, it was actually literally bleeding blood. on it. Yeah. <laughs> were there any tears? Actually, I'm not sure there were tears. Um, I don't think so. Of joy. Of joy. Oh, right. of joy. You yeah. did. Yeah. You were yes. close, so to, close tears to tears at the <laughs> end. Yes. Okay. Because it's just a symbol of what we achieve when we all put our minds together. So this is what you can do with a two euro tray from the local charity <laughs> shop. Cheers. Yay. Cheers! Cheers! A huge thank you to all of our patrons at Lalande who are making this vlog possible. Especially our Dauphin and Dauphine of Lalande. Yadel and Ether, Alice Allen, Anna, Brandon and John, Michael, Daniela, Dan Banda, Lauren Barnes, Vince Barone, Denise Behrens, Linda C. Bradley, Ed Borkowski, Veronica Castillo, Zoe Dork, Sakura Dennis, Jackie Ellison, Nicholas W. Fairfax, Tracy Ferrari, Elle Fine, Caroline Furster, Brenda Gibbons, Abigail Grant, Brenda Harris, Delaine Holbrook, Kim Hasselhoff, David and Tong Henderson, Jacqueline Holmes, Helen Jacobs, Jimmy Kemp, David and Summer Lalande, Victoria Lapine, Janet Huff Lombard, Frank Martin, Kim Matlock, Meredith, Nina Messick, Robert Miller, Kathy Norrie, JC Award, MP, Maureen Palmer, Tamara Price, Tonya Renee, Yvonne and Peter Richards, RJB, Bettina Rojak, Hanny Ross, Elizabeth Scanlan, Sven Schreiber, Lisa Schultz, Jennifer Shanks, Patty Suhu, Susan Stevens, Jenny Stevenson, Sarah Thornton, Colleen Troyer, Jessica Walker, Brandy Walton, Laura Watkins, Greg Wood, David Young, and Ludovico Zordonazzo. And thank you to all of you.